to today's video. Today is noisy in the car. Uh, Sam is saying that there's frost inside the car. How does that happen? <gasps> Happens when it's darn cold, Laura. Darn cold today. Anyway, welcome to today's video. We're headed out. I got like normal clothes on today. I mean, not normal clothes. <laughs> My super warm breeches on. They're called huggers. That's what they're called. They're not called hugs. They're called Huggers. Sam told me they were called hugs, but they're actually called huggers. Probably an off brand. Probably an off brand, but that's okay. I believe in off brands. <sighs> Sam just dropped in the middle of the road. I was not expecting that. Why? Because there's something in the mailbox. Flyers. Flyers, yeah. Almost died. Because the flyers are here! <laughs> Anyway, welcome to, to yeah, flyers and bills. Gabby says she's no see homeschool. He, he he thought it was the bills. Oh, yeah, he was gonna kill us all. Gabby says he thought it was the bills. <laughs> He's gonna kill us all for the bills. Anyway, welcome to today's video. We're headed out to do some shopping. Yesterday I so I have two barn coats. One that I wear like when we go places. It's not too dirty, and one that I wear when we're at the barn. And I spilled my drink all over one yesterday, so today's shopping attire is like my nicer coat. It still fits me, wahoo. <laughs> but anyway, welcome to today. We're headed out to do some shopping before even homeschool. It is 9 a.m. and we are out. We are doing all the stuff that we have to do. It is cold today and we want to get home. Is it cold today? Minus 20. Minus 20. The horses are probably not happy. Did you feed them in or out? Out. out. Yeah, way to be it. Be mad. <laughs> so anyways I also wanted to do, talk to you guys for a second about yesterday's video I wrote Penny and I know this video is not all about me but I do feel like there's things that I need to say to you guys sometimes I wrote Penny in the snow and you guys should know if for any of you guys who have never ridden in the snow if you're a fearful rider if you are just a nervous rider if you are a scaredy cat like me and you come by it naturally, and it's just who you are in the very depth of your soul, then snow riding is for you. You would think that people would be more scared of snow because it's not what you usually ride in, but snow creates this whole different environment. Like, Brandon was starting to break his young horse, and the very first ride he did was out in the snow because what happens for, I find, in snow, if you fall, it won't hurt that much, Sam says. I don't think about that. Don't think about that. Don't not think about that. But that's what Brandon said. But snow hinders the horse's movements. Like, somewhat. Even like a fast, furious horse, it hinders their movements. They can't do too much in the snow. And it's a peaceful ride. Every time I ride in the snow, it's just so peaceful and so amazing. And so, like, I love it. So I have more goals for this winter and I'm just saying I got more goals and I'm going to be doing it. So again, welcome to today and let's get this video started. Alright, so we are in Costco. Sam wants a new TV. Big. Sam's like, let's get it! <laughs> it's 77 inch. 77. 77. The one we want. You can buy the nice one. I like Samsung myself. Samsung is my dream TV. Interesting fact, I had a really nice Samsung TV in my bedroom and then somebody needed it more than I did, so I gave it to them. This year for me, I want it to be about serving other people more than myself. We left Sophie at home because she had her appointment with her tutor and so she needed to continue with that. My mask is inside out, that's super embarrassing. Now that Christmas is over, I'm still eyeing up all the toys. Like, this is such a cool Harry Potter playset. Harry Potter must be coming back out. I also love Leapfrog and all their toys. Like, this globe would be so cool at uh, learning geography. And look at this cool thing that Costco has. They have, like, all those glasses, the little cheater glasses that you wear. And they have the machine here so you can test and see what you need. So I hate Costco. I just want to be that person or the person to say, like I always say, I'm never coming back here because Look, we got a hundred masks. We got a hundred masks? Yeah, and they're black. Oh, I love black masks. It's Everybody like ten dollars. Feel like a superhero when you wear a black mask. No. Nobody, yeah, nobody wears black masks, but I everybody like them. Everybody does. Yeah, I guess everybody who shops at Costco. Okay, so the reasons why I hate Costco, I'm gonna just tell you right now. 
every time you come, it costs three hundred dollars at least, yeah, minimum. The, How much was it for you? But the hot 31. dog costs you a dollar fifty. Yeah, but the hot dog <laughs> costs a dollar fifty. That's how they get you in here. So everything is super sized, which is great in the long run, possibly for saving money. But I've never found it to save us money because the stuff you buy is not like I don't know. We don't. We're a family of four. We don't need super sized stuff. I do like it for like when my grandkids are coming for the weekend to spend like to buy snacks and stuff because you can buy a bigger box and stuff but I don't know it just doesn't seem like it seems so much it seems like so much waste but they do have things that you can never find anywhere else but the reason we come here the only reason we come here is for the hot dogs <laughs> the sausages and also because this is where we buy our dogs food so we have to come every time i come they get me every time i spend so much money and i just get so frustrated <laughs> that i do that i bought stuff for easter you guys i bought stuff for easter yeah how much was this? that okay so i bought this it's for easter so if you don't no, tell them no you can't have it now so we so sophie wants these things they're these magniformers meg formers i want specs but they're like 50 bucks 50 bucks for nine 50 bucks for nine. Oh, they're smaller, right? Yeah, they're like little tiny. Oh, yeah. Balls. So, this is not but what you are, wanted. Like, like them, but just bigger in shapes. But watch out, you're getting dog food. Oh, so I bought the wrong stuff. No, this is it's the stuff that I've also been wanting because it's exactly like Specs. But, but it's bigger. a no name brand and bigger. Well, anyways, the other stuff is like. Is so expensive. This was 60 pieces. The other one was like $60 for 10 pieces. How much is this? This one was uh, 40 bucks. Oh, that's good. She's Such cool. a good price, but you have to wait for your Easter because there's 15 of those, 12 of those, 12 yeah. of those, two of those, yeah. six of those, two of those. Two I of those, listen, of those, two I also bought you some leggings because you need more winter ones. So I also bought a few, like, so we always I buy groceries. We always buy groceries and stuff with, when we're there. We buy dog food. We buy paper towel, toilet yeah, paper. It better not be. It's chicken parmesan lasagna. I'm still not even going to eat it. Oh my gosh, I'm going to eat it. It looks so good. And I also bought sausages. Also, like I said, I bought a bunch of snacks for the grandkids' visit. I try and buy my toilet paper there because it's the same price as Walmart. It's super cheap, but you get a lot. Wait a minute. Yeah, that's paper. That's toilet paper. More snacks. Gabby asked for these Hello Panda chocolate cookies. And then I also love their giant bag of carrots. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> hey, gentle, Gabby, gentle. Remember, she can sit on you now. She's as tall as you almost. Ow! Like the dogs are like. Hair. I'm not holding your hair. <sighs> okay. Listen, there's like 60 she boxes. There's, me. there's like. Me. It's mine! Okay. Get me your dog! Stop stepping on my hair! Let go! Okay, no. now the dogs are fighting too. Look! Look what you're teaching your dogs! No. Look! The Daisy Dog won! Let's see who's gonna win! Who's gonna win? Be careful of the TV! No. <laughs> Gabby, your bum is all dusty. I know! <laughs> Look at the dogs are still trying! Get it to me! Everybody's all stressed out. No, no, no. I won. All right, I say Gabby won. Gabby won. It's over. It's over. her. Today on Instagram, I saw a video of a dog standing over top of a baby. The baby was laying underneath its belly, and it was standing over top of them, protecting the baby from a vacuum cleaner. And I was like, which one of our dogs is like that? Would protect My like dog a... runs to you for protection, actually. <laughs> That's your dog. <laughs> Which one of our dogs do you think would like protect a baby or a child? No one. Oh, I think no. Daisy would. Daisy is always Daisy making sure. Hear. I know. Well, she wouldn't maybe protect it from a vacuum cleaner. <laughs> but she Ruby. does. Ruby would. You protect. think Ruby would? Yeah, right? Yeah. I always question everything that I see and think and feel. Always. Like, I'm always trying to learn more, grow more, be oh, it's more. Oh, so far. Smell it. <laughs> I, it's, it smells like. That's I'm... not so. So, this is soap bar. You put that and then the soap doesn't fall. Just wait. So, you so don't drop oh, the soap. that's cool. But you so, don't drop the soap. 
Anyways, I've discovered I've discovered that Dalmatians are my dream breed. Are they my <gasps> dream breed? What? I'm stealing this. While we were out, a package arrived, and it's for Sam. He ordered it, and this is a soap bar, and it sound good. You put your bars of soap on it. Oh, anyway, never mind. I'm not stealing it. <laughs> it's man yeah. soap. It's, it's called so Squatch. Oh, that's deodorant. Yeah, mm. I was gonna steal it, but then it smells like a man. Yeah, you do not want to smell like man. So he got like four bars of soap, three bars of soap, and some. Oh, he got the cool citrus. That's shampoo and conditioner. Is it shampoo and conditioner? Yeah. Oh, Sim's gonna smell so good soon. I, I've never seen him in the bathroom having a shower. <laughs> I know. He, he never goes to the bathroom to have a shower. Oh, he showers when you're in bed. He showers before bed. Cedar. Cedar. That smells like cinnamon. I heard it. Warm. This one smells like cinnamon. Well, anyways. You guys, Sam is going to be smelling so good soon with this men's natural soap. All right, so this is pine tar soap. That's so like this weird. This is weird. This one's conditioner. Oh. No, I read. No, I read the. It smells like I, pine tar. It, it feels like you're camping. All right, I'll I'll go for it then. It's not that bad. Feel like you're camping. It just stains. No, yeah. it stains. Look. It's strong. It's so strong. So we are moving. No, we're not. <laughs> No, we're not moving. It just looks like we're moving because we had a catastrophe. Yeah, that's what it's called. A catastrophe, you guys. Our I, TV I stand, our amazing TV stand that we bought with the fireplace in it to keep us warm uh, died. It died. And we're trying to find something that's strong enough to hold our TV because our TV is an older TV and we love it. It's big and, and it's some kind of special, I don't know, whatever, Sam's big on TVs. But anyways, it's really heavy and that is what caused the demise of our wonderful TV stand. So we are throwing out our TV stand, saying goodbye. Goodbye, TV stand. <laughs> It actually feels so beautiful out here right now, you guys. Like, it's cold, but look how pretty it is. Like, it just seems so pretty and icy. Like, there's a lot of ice. You gotta go slow. So, Sam is going to burn it. Come on! <laughs> Come on! Me? Yeah. Did I figure it? Yes, I am. Come on. Come on. Do you guys see how Daisy like stays with Sophie all the time? Like she's so, she's so protective and sweet. Like I am shocked by the Dalmatian personality. I'm actually shocked. Like obviously they have health issues that don't plague a lot of other breeds. So I understand why Dalmatians aren't super common pets, but oh my gosh, they're the best breed. Look who's here to meet us today. <laughs> Hi, little mini. Hello. Oh, there's Penny. So I bought these giant carrots today at Costco. They're literally giant. <laughs> Gracie's like, I will come. <laughs> Willow's like, it's too cold. Great to mama. Yeah, hello. Hello. You guys see that? That has a bond. That is a bond. Whoa, and that is scary. <laughs> That's a galloping horse. Go. <laughs> God. All right, have a little bite. All right, have the rest of it. <laughs> that was a giant horse. That was a giant carrot. Okay, so anyways, um, we came down. I just wanted to check the horse's feet. Like, um, ever since Penny had frozen feet the other day, I feel so bad. Even though I know it's normal, I like to make sure she's okay. Come here, give me this foot. Give it to me. See? It's all packed in there again. I gotta get it out. That's so super annoying. I, mean, I can't believe that. I never even knew that that was an issue with horses. I have some, like, spray, cooking spray. I can spray inside of her hooves and prevent that from happening, which I'm gonna do. Oh, it's annoying. But anyways, I want to tell you guys something really quick before we end this video. So, like, we've had so much trouble on our channel with people saying, like, Oh my goodness, you do this, and you do that, and 99% of the time, it's never been accurate. And, 
and I know that a lot of it is a communication issue. We don't spend the time that we should explaining to all the different people what we actually do and the thoughts behind it and stuff. And the reason we do that is because if we took all that time to do that, we wouldn't have a vlog. And so I guess in some ways we allowed our vlogs to appeal to the people that were like-minded and understood without us having to explain. And we, we kind of did not make people who didn't understand feel comfortable here. Does, does that make sense? See, like this keeps happening. It's crazy. Gabby, we need help. Hey, hey, Fanny. Fanny? She's not happy about it. <laughs> this one's like, I will bite your bum. <laughs> oh, give me it. <laughs> give me it. <sighs> I believe in Gabby. I believe in Sophie too. I believe in you, Sophie. I love her new shirt. So the girls got some clothes that they have never worn yet for Christmas. And this is one of Sophie's shirts and she doesn't like it because, she likes it, but she doesn't wear it because she likes a pocket. Yeah, so I can hold my own, but yeah. I don't need a pocket right now because I've been playing on the snow. Yeah. So when I had to try and get it out, I had to wet her foot in water. I got all that out. Yeah. Stan, it's really hard to know how to be inclusive with such a big group of people, if that makes sense. And I feel bad that we, I feel bad that we've made other people not understand by just reason of omission and just not explaining. And I am going to try and do better, you guys, and explain better. Like, Gabby loves Chino. Like, she loves him, and she does lots with him. And, and I never explain. Like, someone said today, like, Gabby doesn't love Chino. She doesn't even walk him from the field, and she does. She always takes charge of him, takes control of his care so she does do all that she does do it all and she loves to do it all but if we're bringing three horses into the barn then we just have to bring three horses and so i'm not bringing gray finn he's not my horse so if he's not bringing gray finn so somebody has to bring gray finn so i can't handle gray finn yeah he says he drags her too yeah so i should bring him yeah just joking chino drags me so we just do, like we make the choice who to bring in based on like who can handle who. Like Finn prefers Sophie, Chino prefers Gabby, none of them prefer me, so I just have to take one. Like we're a family, when it comes down to it, we're just a family that love horses and own horses and we try our best to make sure that our horses know all of us and bond all with all of us so that times when like we're bringing three horses in, we can all bring one safely. Just wait, next one. You got it out? Next one. This oh, one. I think I have a pretty good job of that. <laughs> Gabby said it she, hurts my back, <laughs> she thinks she did a pretty good job of it. You guys should see. My horse is standing here with no with no lead rope, nothing. Just letting us pick her her yucky old feet. Huh. Anyway, I just wanted to say I'm sorry for not understanding how to bridge the gap that was happening sometimes on our channel. And that happens on all channels. Like at some point there are always going to be people that don't understand and don't care to understand, but I feel we did a bit of an injustice to many people who did want to understand by not rising forward and explaining things. And my, and I'm just learning this stuff now. I'm not perfect. Oh, I'm so far from perfect, you guys. I'm like the least perfect back feet. <laughs> back feet, Gabby. <laughs> this one's always the worst one. So, like I. Yeah, so just know that I see you all there. She doesn't, hmm. Just know that I see you all there and I see the hurts that we have caused by omission and by mistakes and even by getting frustrated with things. And I see you and I, and I know you're there and I understand that there you, I understand that it's just a lack of communication and, and explanation on our part. And I just thank you for being there. That's it. Thank you. <laughs> Good job, Penny Pickle. I already gave you the carrot. That's it. You get no more carrots. Good job. Here, check hers. So we've been doing this a lot lately now. What we have to do to keep our horses safe and happy. <laughs> She's good? Let's check the devil. Let's check the devil. Let's check the devil, girl. <laughs> She's so cute. Stand still. 
See, it's like all the training. Oh, look at them. All the training and stuff that we did, all the work we did with them has helped us to be able to just like pop in, check our horses. <laughs> look at this. Penny's like, help, help. <laughs> She's like, I'm getting away because Sophie has the flag. Well, I feel my sister. finger. I can't. I know. Thank you for doing that. I'm sorry your fingers are cold. I can barely feel it. I know. Just the tip of my pinky and this one. I know. That's what happens to me, too. Yeah. When your fingers get cold or start warming up, they hurt. Hurt. Yeah. That's yeah. what happens. You guys know. It, if you Look at all of our pets, though. We got one, two, three, four. My dog's in Oh, there. Molly. Five. Crazy <laughs> <laughs> no. What the heck? What the heck is happening? She can sit. Sit. Molly, sit. Gracie honestly does Good not job. care. Good Gracie job. doesn't care. Sophie could let go of her. She just doesn't even care. She's like, I'll do anything. Gabby's. Yeah, Gabby's horses are all like super socialized. It's just Penny who's a chicken. <laughs> Laura's afraid of chickens. Did you guys know that? Just joking. I'm not afraid of chickens. A penny is a chicken. Don't you know that you're beautiful? Just the